Hi, my name is Dane, and this is a Dane film. After shooting film for a year, I decided that I wanted to take more photos that looked like stills from a movie. And while most of that is how you light and frame a scene, I was immediately drawn towards the actual film that they use to film movies, which led me down a rabbit hole to lead me to Silver Souls. Silver Souls is Kodak Vision 3 motion picture film that's re-spooled into 35mm canisters, but unlike Cinestill or CatLab's film, the Remjet layer is still there, so it requires genuine ECN2 development. I bought three rolls of Silver Souls 250D back in December, and yeah, it took me a while to finish them, but I was honestly just looking for the right time to use them. For my first roll, I loaded it into my everyday carry, the Nikormat FT2. I loaded it back in July, because I wanted to practice taking pictures of fireworks with a shutter release cable, and spoiler alert, I only got one decent exposure. I mean, it's a dope photo. I shot it at like f8 or f11 to minimize focus errors, and I love how it turned out. And that doesn't mean that the other pictures were unusable. I was happy that I got 36 exposures out of it, but this one just speaks to me. For the other two rolls, I used this, an Olympus Super Zoom 800. One of the cameras that my parents used from the Philippines that still works. I mean, it even survived a drop from me, which is more than I can say for other cameras. <laughs> but yeah, I really like this camera. I only use prime lenses or lenses with a set focal length, but to have a camera that actually zooms, it's pretty fantastic. It's also one of the cameras that puts the date on the photos, which would be cool if it could count past the 1990s. Which I guess is a good example of what they were scared of during Y2K. <laughs> So for these last two rolls, I used them back in September for a birthday weekend trip to a music festival in Vegas. These first couple shots I just adore. I love this one especially because it's a great example of a picture that shows life exactly how I saw it with the stationary background and rapidly moving foreground. And as you could probably see from these pictures, it's a very warm film stock. Silver Souls sells a bunch of variations, but instead of getting one of each, I decided to get three rolls of 250D, which is a daylight balanced film. One thing I love about these photos is how easy it is for me to relive the memories of this day after only seeing a single frame. And I think this one picture of Flume perfectly reminds me of how close we were to the stage along with the ground rumbling bass. So yeah, that pretty much sums up my experience with Silver Souls, at least for now. I definitely want to use 500T and 50D next because I both love tungsten balance film and I also wanted to get into using lower ASA films. So we'll see how that develops.